you have ample time, you know, okay. to educate people that about is, that the right. down. Let, what, let, yeah. So let, let me stay let, with you. Let, 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 let me not let, even belabor mm -hmm. this. Let me stay with let's you. Let's appreciate a few things. First mm -hmm. of all, we're late to the party. As a county, we were late to this party. So if anybody says we needed ample time, I would disagree. Because we saw everything that was happening globally. So before it came to, you know, um, before we decided to go to the party, the party was already happening and we knew it. So we were late to the party. Mm -hmm. So there's nothing like an excuse of they didn't know not enough time. Yeah. That one off the table. Let's put that off the table quickly and then we can move on. Now, clarity. And you said that, you know, clarity. And for me, that's the most important thing. So let's go by what Doc is saying. Let's say the president said restrictions. What does that mean? There shouldn't be any form of ambiguity. What does that mean? Doc, do you understand yeah. what I'm saying? Like, so, what does so, that mean? So, so, come to you, we are in a time of the global pandemic, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. The doctors themselves are telling us that this virus is so stubborn that it's adapting, it's mutating, all of these things. We cannot, as at now, see our way clear with it. Mm -hmm. We expect this of it. And yet, you know, first it can't adapt to heat, boom, got you, adapts to heat. Can't be affected, you know, a, a young person can't be affected, got you, young people are dying. Died so, you know, at every point, mm -hmm. this virus is like, hey, hold up. So, even as a people, and when I say people, I mean globally, not just the Ghanaian, mm -hmm. we obviously were not seeing our way clear. Now, let's give credit where credit is due. And here, I would also reference uh education minister and he's famous the virus doesn't move you, you move you move with the virus brilliant so we know what the problem is now when everybody was advocating for lockdown i was advocating mass testing mm -hmm. i really was not big on the lockdown i was big on the mass testing mm -hmm. now the people who advocated for the lockdown including me including you kwame yeah. brilliant point mm -hmm. let's stay home for a period let's deal with it so for a period we know that these are people that are infested we don't you know uh, spread it around makes perfect sense in fact all the countries that have over overcome COVID 19 did that so it's a scientifically tested and proven way to deal with the situation so yeah. the lockdown absolutely spot on yeah i'm so for mass tested because and, i think that that's do another two, way to go we can do the two yes. concurrent yes i think that lockdown mass test and if you put that two together bingo we yeah. are good now, the president comes out and says, restriction. Mm -hmm. And he says, the local watcher seller can go out and sell. The local cocoa seller can go out and sell. <laughs> the MTN. Um, you, you can know, go and use a KVIP. You can go out and use a KVIP. Mm -hmm. Listen. And we fetch water. Ambiguity. It's not. What does restriction mean? It's not. So let okay, me. Okay, so let now me. let's appreciate okay. our context. Okay. Let's appreciate our cultural. That Content. is why he's not doing textbook uh, work. That is why there was you need know. for clarity. Uh, so let, if I can come in. That is why uh, there was need okay. for clarity because okay. of our context. Now, there are homes yeah. in Ghana that do not have walls. Mm -hmm. There are homes that literally run into each other. Yeah. So you can't tell the borderline between this home and that home. Mm -hmm. So if I'm walking in between here, I'm still home. There's a whole stretch. Where if I'm walking around and you yeah. see me and you, 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 you are, I'll tell you I'm home. Uh, I don't know if I'm making sense. Yeah. So our cultural setup here in Ghana, mm -hmm. you do not leave room for personal I, interpretations. I think... You give the rule as is. A, B, C. Finish. We all comply. Yeah. It's always been the case. An ambiguous law is... No, so, no. So, uh, so let's okay. be clear. Mm. Now we've given a directive, and every now and then we come back and we supplement it with Another counter directives. Directive. Yesterday, mm -hmm. here in the office, where in the evening I was telling, you know, um, our boss that a new directive had come. Mm -hmm. That now was saying that it wasn't enough that we'd be moving around with a company car. That the company car now had to have a sticker. And nobody so let's about it. Nobody, I was the only person who knew because I had read that document. And everything I see, I read. I had re yeah. read the whole thing. And this was somewhere around 9 mm. in the evening, late at night. So I was thinking, let's assume that you sent a reporter out. The person, is in the, the person has an ID <coughs> card. You know, the person is in the company car. 
company vehicle, going out to report. In his mind, I've covered all my grounds. He stopped by a policeman. Where is your sticker? Do you know there's going to be a confrontation, yeah. right? Because um, what are you talking about? What sticker? You, you said we should you move know. in company car. This is a branded company car. This is my ID card. Why are you asking me for a sticker? So I'm saying that right from the get-go, yeah. clarity. Yeah. You don't so, come and supplement so, and supplement so and supplement. Because in the beginning, you could move around. No, I have you said, for you. I you said truck truck drivers yes. could operate. Yeah. That's what you said in the beginning. This morning, when yeah. we were coming, Kwame, truck truck drivers were being stopped. Um, so, uh, would you I, uh, accuse me of not complying if you went home, slept, and added some new laws to the, the ones that you brought yesterday? What, 